when the BMW X5 happened. I said alright, sure. Then came the X3, again, I said, fine. After that, we got the X6, uh, okay, I'll play along. My head is still spinning from the X1 and the X4 and now there's an all new X2 coming and I'm like, are you guys sure about this one? To be clear, the car doesn't look bad, especially in that goldish yellow paint, and on paper it sounds just fine. It will launch with a turbo diesel engine, good for 192 horsepower, all-wheel drive and an 8-speed auto. We probably won't get the diesel, but there are turbocharged 4-cylinder variants in the pipeline as well. It'll slot in above the X1, so you can expect it to cost more than $33, 750 And besides the fact that cross Overs are the big money makers right now. My question is why? Why do we need this? It accomplishes the same thing that the X1 does. It will just be more expensive. Whatever keeps the lights on, I suppose.